Hey man, there's some money back here. Like 5,000, is it yours? Yeah, they're mine, man, thank you. It was a test, man. What do you mean a test? This is mine money. Are you recording I me, man? I was just testing you, bro. You're recording me, man. Yeah. Take it easy, hey, bro, man. take it easy. Thank you. Look, um, there's some money back here. Is it yours? No. No, 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 it's not mine. It's not mine. Uh, give me a second. I'm gonna call the last client. Um, hello there. Yeah, I'm your Uber driver from about a half an hour ago. Did you leave some money in the back of the car by any chance? No, they're not, they're not theirs. Um, let me just call on someone else. No, no, no. Listen, um, what's your name? Um, I'm Miguel. Nice to meet you. Look, Miguel. <laughs> Please don't get angry, but this is oh, actually my money. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was just testing you. Okay? And I want you to keep this. No, no, no. I cannot Honestly, accept that. It's yours. What's your name? My name is Alejandro. Well, thank you, Alejandro. Thank you very much. If only more drivers were like you. Just as honest. No, <laughs> thank you. Look, this is my house. And right in front of here, um, that's my house. All right. Could you park there? I got a lot of, uh, some more surprises for you. I don't know if I can, you know. I gotta keep working. Um, do you rent it? Well, they lent it to me, you know. You rent it and then you get a, a percentage, right? Yeah, something like that. Right here? What are you gonna use your money for? Well, for my family, you know, my wife, my daughters. Your daughters and your wife? Um, how many daughters? Uh, Jasmine and Jimena. Beautiful names. Right here? Uh, you can park here, behind this car. Yeah, it's really nice around here. Alejandro. Yeah, it's really nice around here. Look, this is where I'm gonna receive a, uh, your other gift. Here? Yeah, this is okay. This is the right. perfect place. So you were telling me, uh, your two daughters and your wife. Yeah, she's also called uh, Jimena. And how is it going with your family? Well, we're doing what we can, you know. I really like working, you know, for them, always. Mm -hmm. And do you like working as an Uber driver? Yeah, well, it's what I can do right now. This is a huge city. I learn something new every day. And how much do you make at the end of each day? Well... After paying for the gas and paying for the rent, about 400 a day. And how much do you work every day? It's about eight, eight hours, ten hours, depends. Eleven hours most of the Eleven time. hours? For 400? Yeah. Is that a, that's good, right? And do you, are you from here? No, I'm from Kokula. My family is from here. Your family too? Yeah, they, we all live there. How far away is it from here? It's about two hours away if you're driving. I usually make three or four hours. I gotta ride the bus and sometimes they're really stopping for a long time. And well, when I get to the city, they leave me where the cars are. I take the car, uh, I get some gas, I get something to eat, and I start working. And how's your family doing? Well, as I was telling you, we're we do what we can, but the truth is that my my wife, she has a, a disease called palmoplantar psoriasis. Palmoplantar what? Palmoplantar Sorry? psoriasis, yeah. It's an um, autoimmune disease, degenerative. Uh, you know, you get a lot of scabs everywhere, in the, her feet, her body, and she gets like, like scaly, and she gets a lot of bumps, and the body cannot recognize when she's doing good already, so it keeps, uh, inflammation keeps happening, you know, and infection and a lot of things happen to her, so that can be really nasty, be really complicated for her. So, yeah, she's in a lot of pain, basically, every day. And does she require medicines, surgery, what is it? Yeah, she can take some medicines for it, but there's no cure for it, you know. And when was her last therapy? About a year ago. A year ago? Yeah. Look, ideally, it should be weekly, monthly, and but it's really expensive. How often does she need one? Monthly. Weekly. And it, and it was a year ago. Yeah, yeah, well. 
she uses some ointments, you know, um, some natural ointments that help her a little bit. They help a little bit, but they won't cure her, you know. So yeah, she she keeps holding on, you know. She she pushes through. She, she likes to do her best, you know. Do you really love your wife? Like yes, I love her. She's the love of my life. How did you meet each other? <laughs> well, when I was 15, I was a rebel, you know. <laughs> I was always in the streets. I was about a fatal class and I needed to buy some materials. And when I went to the store, she was there, working there. And that's when we met, you know. She sold me some stuff. And I was so lucky just to be able to see her. So beautiful. She had a beautiful smile, you know. And from that day on, I was looking for any excuse to just go see her. <laughs> I was going to buy pretty much anything, even if I didn't need it. <laughs> so that was your excuse, right? To see her. Yeah. And um, how long has she had that problem? Yeah. Since she was little, you know, since she was young. 10, 11, I think. She has been on a lot of treatments and then her parents passed away, so. But the truth is that I really love her, you know, I love her for, for real. So you knew she had this condition when you met her. Yeah. Yeah, she told me. Well, I think it's really kind that you're coming to the city every day so you can work. You know, I think it's what every man, a family man would do. So I think it's really kind. What would you say if I told you that I'm gonna pay for your wife's treatment? <laughs> Are you joking, man? No, for real. Um, what do you think? I'm gonna take care of it. <laughs> I want you to, if it, even if it's gonna be permanent, I'm gonna <laughs> cover for it. I'm gonna cover for your transportation. Oh, don't joke with it, this we're man. We're gonna go to Mexico Please, City, Alejandro. and we're gonna look for a, a good doctor. Would you like that? Uh, would you? Would you like to meet my family so we can tell them? Yes, of course. Where are they? They're in Kukula. Like two hours away from here. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Well, before we go, I want to give you this because this might be helpful. Here you go. What is this? It's just a small gift for you. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. No, no, no. This is just a thank you, you know, for being such a kind person to me. <laughs> How has it been for you? <laughs> All of these expenses? It's really, really hard. But, because you have to work every day, all day, I don't really see him a lot because, well, they understand, right? But it's really sad because I can't really see her. When I get home at night, she's really tired because she's taking care of the kids all day. Um, she does what she can. She she helps around in town, so it's difficult, you know, I just go and get some sleep and then have to work again, back to the city. And what is your family for you? What does it mean? They're everything. Everything, really. They're my reason to wake up, my reason to eat, my reason to live. They're my life, you know. And so you're driving this car, but is it lent, is it rented, or... Would you, would, do you also use a bike or like, of course man, but I can't, I'd rather help my family out a little bit and if I eventually can help them, I'll do it, you know, but this is what I can do right now, 400 a day is what I, I seek, look, so. I would really like to meet your family, is it okay if we go tell them? Yeah, of course, let's go. Listen, but, um, why don't we go in this car instead? Uh, not exactly. Yours? <laughs> no. It's really beautiful, huh? And are you married or something? No, 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 I'm not. But, look. Would you open your, your gift box, please? What is, what's in there, Miguel? Car key? Look, Miguel. I would also like you to have this car. 
Don't joke with this, Alejandro. No, no, no. <laughs> For real. It's yours. I want you to have it. You're an amazing person. Okay. And you're a hardworking man just coming <laughs> to the city to make it. So, please. <laughs> I have no I words. Want you should have it. You don't have to say anything. It's yours. You can use it as an Uber, you can use it for your family, if you want to sell it, rent it, whatever you want, it's yours. I want you to have it. <laughs> thank you, thank you. No, thank don't you. mention it. <laughs> can I give you a hug? Of course, man. Come here. Listen, Miguel. Get in. It's amazing. No, oh, man. This, this never happens. Is this for real? It does happen. You've earned it. Okay. You're an honest person. And it's completely yours. It's a full four cylinder Mazda from this year. So it's gonna work perfectly. So you can go up to the, you can <laughs> get sure to the city. It will. Okay. I want you to enjoy this. You deserve it. And let's go. Give the good yeah, news. Yeah, let's do it. Your family. Do I start it right? here? Yeah. You can start it right there. Okay. Step in the brake. Sounds beautiful, man. Yeah, these cars are really well done. So, um, it's gonna be really useful for you. Let's go tell your wife <laughs> that she's gonna have a uh, permanent treatment. <laughs> Thank you very much. No, don't Thank mention you. it. I really hope this helps. And uh, this is all for you guys. <laughs>